गुड आफ्टरनून मैम एम आई ऑडिबल एस यूर ऑडिबल हेलो मैम फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल थैंक यू सो मच फॉर गिविंग मी दिस चांस टू हैव अ कॉन्वर्सेशन विद यू मैम आई एम सो नर्वस एक्चुअली योर नेम इज नेहा राइट यस मैम नेहा सेन गुप्ता सो यू आर फीलिंग नर्वस यस मैम सो फर्स्ट हैव अ ग्लास ऑफ वाटर यस श्योर सो दैट यू गेट कंफर्टेबल नाउ वी कैन हैव द कॉन्वर्सेशन सो यू फील बेटर यस मैम डोंट बी नर्वस बिकॉज़ मोस्ट व्हाट विल हैपन यू विल मेक मिस्टेक्स and i'm here yes ma'am I, i don't worry about mistakes and you also don't worry about mistakes okay yes ma'am sure ma'am so neha yeah. please introduce yourself first so that i get to know you okay like you already know my name my name is neha sen gupta and uh, my family hails from himachal but currently i'm living in delhi with my, my husband and about my qualification i have done my bachelor of arts from delhi university and uh, about my work experience i have uh, almost uh, Nine years of experience. My last job profile was a uh, quality and training lead. And uh, about my family, we are three members in my family: my husband, me, and my father-in-law. My husband works in a BPO as a manager, quality and quality and training manager, and my father-in-law is a retired BRO officer. Okay. Yeah. So when did you get That's married? All about it. It's been almost uh, six years, ma'am. Okay. Six years, ma'am. Yeah. Mm-hmm. so it's not an interview i'm not taking your interview you are not a candidate so please be comfortable <laughs> just relax and think like you know just like you are talking to a friend okay so we are just yes, having a conversation it's not an interview okay yes i'm actually since childhood i have a problem whenever i talk to a stranger i always got nervous and start stammering so that is my issue okay okay don't worry uh, just be comfortable you will not stammer okay yeah sure okay so currently you are doing some job And no, ma'am. I'm a house manager since last six years. Okay. So why did you leave that job? Actually, uh, ma'am, there are so, so many things we have to do reluctantly after getting married. I hope you can understand. <laughs> so after marriage, you yeah. couldn't continue your job. That is why you had to leave it. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. So are you enjoying your life as a homemaker? Yes. Somehow I feel uh, like enjoying, but uh, somehow I feel depressed because. Uh, it is not easy to be at home and uh, just doing house chores <laughs> but uh, I, i am doing so many things like i uh, i like to read books so i have so many novels and uh, watching your video is one of my uh, is in my routine actually whenever i do my house chores anything i put earphones and uh, start watching your videos okay. and i have uh, learned a lot from your videos ma'am Thank you so much. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Whenever you suggest something to someone, I follow that, uh, and uh, I, I'm finding uh, so many difference in my communication now. Okay. So you think there is a lot of improvement after watching my videos? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So yes, why ma'am. do you want to improve your English communication? Ma'am, actually, uh, you know, nowadays English becomes a, a status symbol as well. Right. And uh, I don't want to. Uh, feel like fool in front of my friends so that is so i want to improve my communication and also i want to utilize my free time yeah and yes, it's ma'am. an international language it's useful also but yes, yeah ma'am. in india it is used as a status symbol also and it is used professionally also and you need it in interviews and everywhere but yeah. many people use it only for show off right yes ma'am so uh, what are you doing to improve your english uh, first i'm regularly watching your videos and apart from this i'm uh, i have joined one app that is josh talk app and i'm regularly using that app and uh, i'm reading some books and uh, uh, i always try to make some videos my own videos on any topics so that is all i'm doing to improve my communication okay, you record yourself you speak on a topic yes, and you record yourself then you watch yes, that video and see what mistakes you made no ma'am <laughs> i don't have any one So you don't watch that video which you record? I watch the video and try to rectify the issues okay. and grey areas. Yeah. And you have been watching my conversation videos. Apart from that, uh, yes, do you speak to people regularly? Like, are you doing speaking? I try to. Also, ma'am, uh, honestly speaking, not regularly. Uh, I try to speak with my husband because, but he don't have that much time. Time because uh, he is busy with his work, and uh, I try to speak on Josh Talk app. Mm, and yeah only josh talk app but uh, since last 3 or 4 days uh, i am not uh, doing any call on josh talk app 
we don't say since three four days. We say for three four days. So for last okay. three four days, you have not been using Josh Talks app, and your husband yes. is fluent in English, but he doesn't have time. That is why you can't do your speaking practice with him. Okay. Yes, ma'am. So what is your experience yes. with Josh Talks app? Do you make audio calls on it? Yes, ma'am. Uh, when I take my first call, I got stuck because I'm an introvert person, and it is uh, so difficult for me to talk with a stranger, and I was so afraid. So I stuck, but uh, I never give up. I try to speak with the other person and uh, answer them, and uh, gradually I, I I find some confidence in me. I now I can say that I I'm a bit confident. Okay. While talking in Josh Talk app, yes. Since you narrated a past incident, this happened in the past, so you should say everything in past tense. So you can say, when I made my first audio call, I got stuck. I was feeling nervous, and that day I couldn't speak. But I didn't give up, and I made another call. And slowly and gradually, I, you know, got confidence. My confidence went up. So now I'm able to make audio calls on Josh Talk. Audio calls is fine. Yes. So. um are the co-learners i mean serious to learn this language with whom honestly talk? speaking yes i'm actually most of the people on josh talk app uh, has uh, not they didn't have that much knowledge about this language only few people i have uh, i made one friend uh, jayanti she is from uh, arunachal pradesh and she has a very good command over this language so i used to call her on daily basis and uh, she is the one who um, who gave me the feedback about my communication and about my mistakes okay she you yeah. met her on josh talks app only yes ma'am and you became yes, friends okay so yes, now you call her on her personal number or on josh talks only josh talk and on uh, whatsapp on personal number okay yes. most of the people on josh talks are not very fluent in english that's what you wanted to say yes ma'am most and, of the people uh, yeah and are these people willing to learn this language or they are here for only time pass as i can say that uh, 40% of people are only doing doing time pass okay and rest of the people are here to improve their communication mm -hmm. so most of them are not serious about making any progress in english speaking no ma'am okay. yes ma'am do you think they just want to have a conversation with anyone okay Yeah. So, do you think this app is helping you? Do you think it has improved your English fluency? Initially, yeah, this app this app helped me. But now, um, I think uh, one of your video you have uh, suggested one app, Sparky app. Yes, yes. So, I'm planning to have that app to okay. download that app and yes. start uh, communicating on that app because on that app, mm -hmm. AI will tell me uh, my gray areas. Right, right. At the same, so that I can improve. Yeah. yeah, and uh, you will be sure that it is not making any mistakes. It will correct your grammar mistakes, pronunciation mistakes, and it will be correct all the times. On audio calls, you are not sure whether the other person is speaking mm -hmm. in correct English or not. So here, yes, it yes. speaks grammatically correct English, and it corrects your mistakes also. Yeah, it, yes, this app is very uh, helpful as well as it is very very affordable. Yeah. Yeah. Ha. Hundred rupees per month, no ma'am. Right. If you take the six months subscription, but if you take one month subscription, then I think it's two hundred or two fifty a month. Okay, so okay. Much better to take the six month subscription. I'm planning to have the six month yeah. subscription. Yeah. Okay. So you will find that in the description of this video, and you can you know download the app from that. Okay. Sure, ma'am. So tell me, as a wife, do you feel appreciated for what you do at home? Yeah, my husband always praises my cooking and. Uh, whatever i do she he is the only one who supports me not only when my father in law is also very supportive okay. yeah ma'am he praises what you do he understands that you also do a lot of hard work because most of the people yes, think that homemakers they do nothing homemakers yeah. do nothing and they just sit at home most of the people yeah. have that misconception yes ma'am uh, do you have a specific topic on which we can do the conversation so that it becomes interesting uh, topic ma'am you You can tell me any topic, and we'll have conversation on that. Okay. You suggest any con uh, topic. Okay. So we can have a conversation like, uh, let's say your husband comes back from office, and then you talk to each other. So when he comes back, what does he say? First, yeah. Please bring me a glass of a water. Oh, he said, "Give me a glass of water." Yes. So I bring a glass of 
water to him and uh, after that he go to the bath to take a shower and uh, i start making tea for him okay so you can see he goes for a bath he takes a shower or you can say he goes for a bath he go to take a bath is wrong he goes because okay. he is singular so you can say goes okay. okay so he goes for a bath or he takes a bath or he goes for a shower yeah and then you start preparing tea okay then yeah. and then after when he came out uh, after taking a shower then i bring tea for him and uh, after having tea uh, within uh, 30 minutes i start preparing for dinner and uh, at 11 o'clock sharp we had we have our dinner and uh, after dinner uh, we came back to our room <laughs> okay i will point out a few mistakes here you said when he came from shower did you say that yes ma'am but if this is present tense when he comes out when he comes okay. out or when he comes then i i bring him a cup of tea we have tea together and then you do that every day no? yes ma'am that's like a daily routine so you can say after dinner we come to our room or we go to our room okay, okay. i don't know because i'm nervous since i'm making so many mistakes <laughs> no 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 don't, don't worry so i'm not correcting you to make you nervous i am just correcting you so that okay. you get to know what mistakes you are making and you are aware of yes, them yes ma'am but making mistakes mm-hmm. is important and i would encourage you to make mistakes so don't worry about that yeah it's my job to correct them yes, right so please keep making mistakes okay so i want to know what conversation do you have when you are in the room when you both go back to the room after your dinner so tell me the conversation what do you talk about i always ask him how was your day what what new you have uh, done today is there something new and uh, i uh, i told him about my day what i have done to i tell him i tell him about my day because this is i present. i tell him i tell him about my uh, day and uh, preparation for the next day and uh, yeah okay only few few conversation we have and uh, because it's so late and uh, okay he asks you what are you going I, to prepare tomorrow yeah okay. so for his lunch okay tell me how do you talk to each other when you fight then does your husband suddenly start speaking english instead of hindi <laughs> no 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 he start speaking actually, english they fight actually i am the one who always keep fighting with him he oh. is very calm he is very calm type of person he is very calm uh, he always handle me with person yeah. and you are aware that you are the one who fights always <laughs> okay <laughs> so, okay even then you don't mend your ways <laughs> yeah okay so tell me a typical conversation tell me about a conversation that happens during a fight i always fight him for his time because he always busy with his work and after uh, after came back to house he always busy with his phone so i have a issue with his phone i don't want him to use phone at night he always have a uh, habit of using his phone till 2:30 midnight okay So he always watches back Netflix home. and movies. When he comes back home, he keeps using his phone, and that is why you have you have this issue with him that he keeps using his yeah. phone, and you don't want him to use the phone after he comes back home. He keeps using the yes, phone two thirty a.m. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Then what do you say to him? You always busy with your phone. You don't have time for me. And why am I here? If you are always busy with your phone, you should marry with your phone. Not okay. with me. <laughs> okay. Okay. So you say you are always busy on your phone. Then what am I doing here? Yes. <laughs> yes. Ma'am. You should have got married to your phone, right? You should have got married with your phone first. Yeah. Okay. So then, what does he say? He just looks at me and smile. Sorry, I will not use it. But again, next day, he repeats the same thing. Okay. Then he repeats the same thing. Okay. <laughs> yes. Ma'am. Then you start fighting again. So sometimes yes, you get very very angry and start scolding him also. No, I I never scold him, but yeah, sometimes my, my volume. Okay, sometimes you raise your become some louder. You raise your voice. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yes, I raise your I I, I raise my voice sometimes. So does it ever happen that initially get so angry that you stop talking to him for a few days? No, uh, actually, uh, he he know how to uh, convince me for forgiveness. So okay. so he knows how yeah. to convince you for something. Yes ma'am. Okay. 
Mm-hmm. So then he doesn't let you stay angry. He will always come mm-hmm. and you know persuade you. He will convince you. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Yes, ma'am. So do you ever hide his phone or you snatch his phone? <laughs> so many times. <laughs> But whenever I try to do that, he always got angry. He doesn't likes me to touch his phone. Okay. Yeah. He doesn't want you to touch that his phone. Issue. And whenever you do that, he gets angry. Is there a secret there? <laughs> <laughs> no, ma'am. There is nothing secret because uh, whenever he go for a, uh, whenever he goes to a, have a bath, I always check his phone. There is nothing to be hide. <laughs> oh my God! So you check his phone whenever he takes a bath. Yes. Yeah. You check and his. He phone. knows that. So you know he knows password. that. He knows that you are checking it. Yes. So he, and you know the password. You know. Yes, ma'am. I know <laughs> because it's my name. <laughs> oh wow! So great. Yes. Okay. Yes. Tell me something interesting. Tell me some interesting incident. Uh, ma'am, actually, uh, I'm a Himachali girl, and uh, my husband is Bengali. So when I got married, newly, and I don't know how to cook the Bengali food, but my mother-in-law helped me a lot. He taught me. When the, you got married, she is like, you know how to cook Bengali food. So your yes, mother-in-law ma'am. taught you that, okay? Yes, and uh, I before marriage I never eat uh, fish, but after getting married. now I, i i love fish <laughs> i yeah because the way my mother in law taught me to uh, make fish okay. the way your mother in law taught you that is amazing okay so uh, yeah. where does your mother in law live actually we live together but uh, two two years ago she she died okay so she passed away two years ago okay uh, mm-hmm. your father in law how does she pass time all day i mean how does he pass his time without his wife she must be very sad no yeah ma'am sometime sometime but uh, he he always keep on watching the uh, news and with his phone and uh, there are so many things for the house so okay. he always take care of that yeah okay so he keeps watching tv news and he uses his phone yeah. all the time okay to keep himself busy and does he have friends also uh, no ma'am i don't see i didn't see any friend of him uh, his but uh, yeah uh, his with he actually he's a role model for me as well because he always take care of himself like he, he's uh, above 70 age mm-hmm. but still he take care of himself he always uh, do uh, exercises yoga everything and uh, because he his background is from bro so uh, everything is disciplined in his life timing is fixed for everything for tea for lunch for breakfast everything everything is fixed okay yeah. so he has a disciplined routine and he follows yes, a good routine every day and he yes, exercises ma'am. every day so every day. role model for you do you, do, you don't exercise yes, every day <laughs> no ma'am <laughs> so does he go out also or he mostly stays at home mostly he stays at home he, doesn't he ask you both to have children no uh, not Uh, yet yeah, and not till now he actually uh, I, i am his daughter in law so he doesn't have that that kind of conversation but he me. must have said that you his son he can't say that yes ma'am but he yes, says that to his son okay yes ma'am. he okay. said that to his son so where does your mother live uh, initially uh, they were living in chitranjan park new delhi mm-hmm. yeah but now we all lives in chatrapur Okay. West Delhi. Mother also lives there. Ach, my mother. Your she mother. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. She lives in Janakpuri. Yeah. She lives in Janakpuri. Okay. She lives in Janakpuri. You, you visit her regularly? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Not regularly. Occasionally. Okay. You watch English movies and serials also? Yes, ma'am. I am very fond of watching K dramas. Okay. K dramas, E dramas, and uh, interviews in English. Priyanka Chopra Jonas' uh, motivation speeches in English. Yeah. So K dramas, uh, you watch them dubbed in English. Yes, ma'am. They okay. are dubbed in English. Okay, that is good for improving English. And tell me the one. Uh, tell me the K drama that you love the most. The cute bodyguard. The, the cute, cute bodyguard. bodyguard. Okay. Yes, ma'am. So I am currently I am also watching a K drama right now, and that one is okay. uh, the uh, uh, what was it? Startup. Have you seen that one? Startup. No, ma'am. Okay, mm-hmm. you've not seen that, but that's an amazing yes. one, and I'm currently watching mm-hmm. it, and I am on the last episode. Mm-hmm. 
so today okay. i will be finishing it and today that uh, show will be over so you are saying the cute bodyguard i think i will cute bodyguard i will take your suggestion and watch that yeah. <laughs> i will start it yeah um, so okay. uh, that is also that has only 16 episodes i think 25 25 yeah. so there are two yeah. seasons or one season only one season only okay one, one season, season 25 only. episodes yes ma'am so it's a nice one it's a rom com yes ma'am okay it's a nice one yeah okay you will enjoy watching that uh, k drama short okay so i because the bodyguard is a girl oh the cute bodyguard is a girl okay that cute bodyguard is a girl <laughs> okay. yes ma'am so <laughs> initially when i started watching k dramas i used to feel like you know, they all look alike i used to feel that they all looked alike yeah. don't you think so <laughs> yeah Chinese also. Only can I look like her? How will I differentiate? But when I started watching these shows, then when you keep watching them, then you understand, yar. There are subtle differences yeah. in their features. But yes, ma'am. You know, upper se lagta hai ki you know they all look alike. <laughs> <laughs> Same. Yeah. Same with the Chinese also. Right. Also. Right. Yeah. Chinese and Nepalese are looking yeah alike. Yeah. Right. Uh, do you have any questions for me? Ma'am, uh, tell me something to remove my hesitation. Okay, so you want to? I read... know what should be the sentence. I know the answer, but uh, because of the nervousness, I I always messed up. See, the problem is you have been practicing only on audio calls. On audio calls, you only hear the voice. So yes, ma'am. As you keep making audio calls, you are not facing anyone. So yes, that way, you don't get to face your fear, isn't yes, it? You should take subscription of an app where you get connected to tutors. Okay. and you should like make clapping go like clapping go or ace fluency or any other app where you have okay. to talk on video calls or you can request okay. youtubers like me to give you a session okay. right so you can do sure. that but if you just keep talking on audio calls nervousness and hesitation will not go yes ma'am isn't it this is the first time i'm talking to someone on video call okay that's so why i'm getting first nervous time. so you are nervous yes, right this is your first time that is why you are nervous but when you made your first audio call that day you were nervous no yes ma'am so but you slowly yes, became comfortable no you yes, slowly became comfortable yes ma'am with a lot of audio calls in the same way when yes, you make some 40 50 of video calls then you will become comfortable and you will not get nervous i am telling you okay ma'am okay so I'll first try to have a video conversation subscription of sparky so that you can practice whenever you want and very very it's very very affordable and after you sure. become fluent you take another subscription where you speak to people on video calls okay sure okay ma'am sure ma okay okay you spoke well today and uh, just keep practicing best of luck thank you ma'am thank you so much yeah thank you, you so welcome. much okay then bye bye have a great day bye ma'am yeah we okay. can connect again after 2 3 months you can send me message again sure ma'am sure ma'am i will okay, then sure. bye bye okay bye ma'am